Taurus. Taurus cross watches. People want to know where the Taurian energy is doing in their charts. You're all welcome. You're all welcome. Welcome back, as a matter of fact, Boris. Uh, shout out to all the Tauruses that have been viewing the channel, too. Appreciate y'all. That goes for everybody included. You know what I mean? Um, all the new subscribers, shout out to y'all. I see y'all. Much gratitude for y'all. Um, and everybody who's been rocking with me from when you began rocking with me as well. So, what we gonna get into? Four card draw. I ain't gonna hold you long. Pause. Uh, we're doing outcomes today. Pause. And everything still applies if you wanna get in contact with me for a reading. All right? Um, that would be going to the description box. There'll be a link to my website. You can scroll it. You'll see the rates. You can click on the button. Set up an appointment via Google Meet. Pause. Or if you just want to get on the telephone and chop it up, we can do that. You understand? I adjust. I'm a mutable sign. I am capable of doing that. And um, with that being said, let's get these cards read. I also came across a better way, I feel, more comfortable way of reading. So bear with me, y'all. But I'm going to just bring out all of the cards so I can see the bigger picture. Step back from it and then start to interpret, all right? So the first card, which is the situation I am, what we got here? We have the Eight of Swords in reverse. Second card, which is going to be the obstacle here for the Taurian energy, we have the King of Wands. The third card, what we have here, is going to be the action recommended to take, which is the Four of Swords in reverse. And lastly, we have the result if that action recommended is taken, which is the three of wands. All right, so now that we have that situated, let's unpack this, shall we? <laughs> so you've seen, you found a solution to escape something. I would say it's more of a mental trap than anything. Something that has bogged you down mentally for... It wasn't a long time. It wasn't a long time. This is something that happened briefly in your mind. Um, to the point where you thought it was something about options. So it's either you felt you didn't have enough options or you felt like you had to make a choice from the options that you had. But what I'm getting here is that you found out that you have the freedom to not choose any option at all. This could be based upon something that you do for work. And when I say that, I mean the freedom that you have to not have to make a choice. Um, okay. But what I'm also getting here, because we have the King of Wands in the obstacle position right someone is looking at you someone has their eye on you and this person has authoritative status they might even be wanting to invest in you but they may come across too impulsively they may have came across too impulsively to you and because I get it, it kind of looks kind of suspect here. I ain't going to lie. Because it seems like they had their eye on you coming out of that trap, that mental trap. And they might have been like, oh, it's just like how people wake up and they don't want them to wake up type shit. Because they're going to be hip to something. You know what I'm saying? I'm picking up on that kind of vibe. Maybe. Maybe because I get the I get the feeling that this person wants to be the boss of you. 
They want to be a boss of you in some type of way. And um, this is the type of boss figure that will inspire you. They come across as an inspirer, as a word. They inspire you, right? So they'll be like, yeah, I seen you do such and such. It was great. I like how you did that. I like how you do that. I like how you move. You know what I'm saying? And then the next thing you know, they're telling you how you should do it next time, when you should do it next time, wear this, don't wear that. You understand what I'm saying? And they got a repertoire. They have a reputation already. They're situated. So one might look at that as like, okay, well, that's the green light. That's big homie or whatever. I should take advice from them because look what they've done. But this is in an obstacle position. They're already a leader in their own right. So you coming out of a situation, realizing that you have options and you don't have to choose from your options. Perhaps this leader in the obstacle position is one of those options and you can actually skip over their asses too. I'm just keeping it a beam with you. I'm just reading the cards. I'm just channeling you. So the action recommended here is really to continue from that escaping this mental entrapment here, more swords energy, to find the mental strength to truly come out of that shit and rejoin the world. Because this, this and again, this was a, a, a rapidly, this rapidly happened. This mental fog or confusion that you had or that had you caught up it also had you isolated. So I don't know, a birdie flew through the window. Somebody sent you some some text message of some sort that got you inspired. Like, yo, you know you that bitch or you know you that motherfucker, right? Fuck you waiting on. We ain't seen you in a minute type shit. You know what I'm saying? But this was not only one person. More people was coming. More people was coming. Pause. That's why. That's why. You know? But they were. <laughs> they were. And um. <laughs> so yeah. The action recommended is to get out there. You know what I'm saying? To really wake up. So like I said, this person is looking at you like, oh no, they're going to wake up. They're going to wake up. The action recommended is saying to wake up. And what's going to happen if you take the action that's recommended is you're going to start traveling somewhere. You're going somewhere. I would say it's going to be a short distance trip because there's three wands here. So I would apply that to the Gemini rule in the third house, short distance travel. Could be a couple of states over, could be a couple of counties over, could be a couple of blocks over. A few, not a couple. Um, but this could be some foreign land too, don't get it twisted. It could be some foreign land too because you are looking out in the distance. Perhaps you've conquered your immediate community in some type of way. So it kind of like opens up. Like you could be a, like a diehard New Yorker or some shit like that, you know what I'm saying? So people know that about you. So it's like you could go to many other different cities based upon that. This is if you choose to do so, though. I'm saying it's an either or type of um, outcome. But it's also important that you have a self-belief about yourself. Well, it's not even important. Should you take the action recommended to get involved again, to come out of isolation, to talk with people and, and rub shoulders and realize you don't have to choose out of your options, I think to some to to some degree, let things transpire organically, then you will accumulate the confidence, the self-confidence needed to be at this level. Success is here. Um, and you'll be happy with the choices that you make when you when you choose to take that step. I'm going to leave that right here. There's no, there's no need to even drag that. Until next time, y'all, I'm out.